genuinely, y'all, I don't think people understand the sentimental behind this camera. Like, y'all, me and this camera, y'all, it's just, I'm getting so emotional. It's like, I was ready to upgrade for quality. Like, I was ready. But please do understand, I still wanted this camera to work when I got my new camera and, um, <laughs> yeah, I'm getting so emotional. <laughs> okay, y'all, I'm back. Y'all can't see my face because I look so ratchet right now and I'm recording off the iPhone because <laughs> I still don't got a camera. But that's not the point. That's not the point, y'all. The point is this camera holds so much sentimental value. Um, it will always, I'm always going to keep it. It's always going to run. I might can get it fixed. I ain't going to even lie. But it's just always going to remind me of where I started with YouTube. Literally. So, y'all, I'm still getting a new camera. I just haven't, I haven't made my decision, honestly. And <laughs> it's not like it's extremely hard decision. It's just that um, I just haven't made my decision yet. Like, I don't know. I'm indecisive. And it's like. Because I'm, <laughs> I have like three options, really four. The Canon G7X is last place. The Sony ZV-1 is first. The Canon M50 is in the running. And then the Sony A7000. So those are my, my top three choices. The M50 Canon is so huge, 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 huge. You can't put it in there on purse, none clutch. It's big and bulky, but it has good quality. The Sony, good quality, compact. You can take it anywhere. But, folks is out here saying the battery on the Sony don't last that long, y'all. This Canon, my Canon battery be lasting. Like, that's a good battery in that camera. <laughs> I don't know if it's just this specific one. Because I don't know how the G7X is. I feel like the G7X is probably... I feel like all Canon batteries probably run at the same capacity. So, yeah. And then the Sony A7000 was just like another option because they have good quality or whatever. But, yeah. I don't really know, y'all. It's Friday. Um, this is going to be a weekend vlog. Y'all are going to see this in real time on Sunday. So, this is going to be what I did at Florida Georgia weekend. Because I'm not, I'm not doing anything on Florida Georgia weekend. Because I don't feel like being around and people... And getting drunk and stuff y'all and i'm starting my new year on monday november 1st so y'all i'm on the way to get my nephew y'all know the one that was sitting right there to my what you say so i'm babysitting him this weekend um wasn't exactly in my plans but here we are I got three white bitches like it's pot of day. What? Make coke with the rolls like a sharp bay. Yeah, yeah. yeah, bitch, I could be a fantasy. I could tell you that. Let's do a little car, a little car jam. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I was born rich. I just ain't got my pay me. Y'all waiting on my pay me, dog. Yeah, I'm taking a break. Cause I let my la I let my lashes go, but honey, I just let myself go after I came back from New York. I ain't even mean, and I still got this little nail that won't come off. It's just a lot. It's a lot. It's a lot. Um, but I do take breaks from wearing nails, get my lashes done and stuff. Like I don't know. I just feel like it'd be good to feel free. Cause like with those lashes, bitch, you rub y'all wrong, bitch. They just start falling out. Like, and don't get me wrong. Like it's not that someone put them on wrong but that's just how sensitive they are you have to take care of them they're precious so um i'ma wait hello no questions in the bottom of this video because i'm gonna do a q and a i feel like a q and a is very appropriate because i'm at a thousand subscribers a lot of people is catching up on my channel they don't really know me like that Y'all probably got questions and I'm ask I'm answer them. So, <clears throat> but I'm gonna say it again at the end of, at the end of this vlog so that y'all can remember to ask me questions. I will put it on Instagram, but I feel like a lot of y'all don't follow me on Instagram. So if y'all not follow me on Instagram, go follow me on Instagram. Cause if you're not, then why you not? Tell me why you ain't follow me on Instagram. I really 
truly I miss y'all I have not been vlogging I have not been vlogging since y'all seen that vlog from Monday of this week where I told y'all I brought my camera I haven't vlogged since then so y'all I miss y'all, I miss talking to y'all, I miss the car rides, I miss everything, like I truly, truly miss y'all, like I was just in a funk about my camera, and like I said, I explained to y'all earlier what was going on about the camera, I just, I'm undecided and I don't want to just make a purchase, because that's a big purchase, like, big purchases give me anxiety, give me anxiety, because it's a lot of money, and a lot of my money I'm spending, now if it was somebody else's money I was spending, you know, i do it with ease, but when it comes to my money, uh-uh. So we take our time over here when we purchase them. We want to let y'all know to get y'all one of these cleaning extenders. I mean, ain't never been in the tub again. And y'all, I think I'm gonna order the pink stuff for this tub because I swear to y'all, this shit is so cheaply made the way it's stained. I'm gonna try everything under the sun to get this shit clean. And at this point, I'm turning to the pink stuff. I gotta Google on where to get it from. But yeah. See y'all, the front of the tub be coming clean. Well, not even, it didn't really get stained. It's this back part. I don't know what the heck is going on. I literally feel like I've tried everything under the sun. I did Dawn and vinegar. My cousin gave me some stuff. I don't know. I'm gonna just say it's cheaply made because I never had no problem like with the bottom of a tub staining wherever I lived at. This shit just cheaply made though. But I'm gonna. Y'all look who back though. Tuka, say hey. Say hey. Hey, so I'm Nicole and go. <laughs> Sit down! I should have put your seatbelt on right, y'all. Don't mind it. We about to stop. Sit down, cause y'all this man, look, look how the seatbelt is. He always getting out the seatbelt. How? I don't know. Hey y'all, so it's like 11.51. I was being supposed to go grocery shopping y'all, but I had stopped at my mama's house and this um, man. I say I eat my soda and my french fries. You drink your soda. <laughs> you drink your soda, eat your french fries. But y'all, I had to stop at Popeyes, y'all. It was, it wasn't, it wasn't even good. That's why I don't be eating out like that no more. I promise y'all, the last couple times I've eaten out, it's been nasty and I picked over it. Like these fries was not even fresh. They weren't, they weren't fresh at all. And I didn't even get me a meal. What I did was because he will or will not eat the chicken nuggets. And today. He did as I thought. He didn't eat chicken nuggets. So I ate the little nuggets. I got a little four-piece nugget and a fry. And I just got a small fry on the side for myself. I ain't gonna drink none of that because Cause I just knew I when I came up to Popeye that it's gonna be on book. Yes. Yeah, why we pull up to the Popeye's, get to the speaker, they like, oh the speaker's broke. Take a careful look at the menu and then pull around so you can um place your order. They not open on the inside, they drive through only. Y'all got too many issues for all that. Like, too many. Y'all, he done met a friend in the store. I can't do it right now. He said, play good. That man. He did not say that. This is what I got so far. Y'all know I'm going to do a little Whoa. haul. Really? I got a new phone. I never knew you had a phone. I know. I got a new phone. So I got a new phone. Okay, y'all. So I just got back from Aldi. Let me just show y'all everything I got in this little grocery haul. So I got some cotton candy grapes, some Atlantic salmon, some steelhead trout, broccoli, y'all. These are so freaking good. These garlic butter mussels popped here. Some lettuce. Huh? Yeah. Some spinach. <laughs> some 
<laughs> Heavy whipped cream, y'all. Some cheese, some soup, some chicken broth, some seasoning, some tomatoes, um, mushrooms, and some Granny Smith apples. And that is what I got. And y'all, I spent, let's see. I spent $48. The highest thing I got on here was the trout and the salmon. Everything else was $3 and under. Well, $2.50 and under, actually, because the highest, the, the $2.49 for the mussels, or $3.09. What did I pay $3.09 for? Oh, for the cheese. But yeah, everything else was like inexpensive. But y'all, if y'all got, I think they sell these at Kroger. If you have a Kroger, they sell these at Kroger's too. But y'all, these are so good. I got a tram. They the bomb. So y'all, this is what I'm wearing. The leggings are from Forever 21. This little bando is from Fashion Nova. And this plaid crop is from Fashion Nova. I mean, this plaid shirt is from Fashion Nova. And I just like buttoned it up and supposed to be giving a little shoulder action but i don't know what it's trying to oh my bad i'm shaking y'all i don't know what it's trying to give but here's the fit of the day and then i just did my hair in this slick back bun for the win slick back bun for the win hey y'all so i'm dressed as y'all see my outfit in the clip before. But um it's the slick back button for me, y'all. My hair is growing so freaking good. Transparency moment, y'all. My hair was not growing for at least prior to this year. So 2020, my hair was not growing. It was actually falling out. I don't know what was going on. But <laughs> It's been making progress. My hair has grew like three inches within the last two months. Very proud of it. Um, I've been trying to take better care of my natural hair so that it can grow. Like my hair has potential to grow before. I'm sorry, I'm looking at the face. My hair has potential to grow. Um, I grew my hair out about right here before I cut it originally. And ever since I cut it, <laughs> y'all, and that was in 2013, I promise y'all my hair was not growing back. Well, I kept my shortcut for years um i just started growing my hair back in i want to say 2018 and it was growing good but then like i wasn't really taking care of it when i was taking out weaves so yeah that's that that that's that that is what happened with that and guys that is why you take care of your natural hair if you dress y'all because she's about to go play so i was like i don't even really feel like all day today I'm just him keep on what he got on. His outfit is decent enough. I mean, I don't really have on anything major. I'm just got on some leggings and a top with a little plaid shirt. It's just me, so it look real good. It look real expensive. But it really ain't. Lip combo is just in case someone wants to know. The Ulta Beauty Plumped Up Pout Lip Gloss in the color is clear. So I don't know what they call this color. And then I added this um, butter gloss, cinnamon roll butter gloss on top. And we have a look. I need my sunglasses up. Now I'm ready to roll. Put this on. So y'all, this time my food look, I got the crab cake sliders and I got some marmalade sauce and then it's jack sauce. I'm at Jack's fish fry. I know, it's a fish. 
So y'all, I'm about to eat this real quick. I'm gonna let him have the fries. And I'm about to go to my mama's house. So y'all, the place I wanted to take him to, which I gotta hurry up finish talking, the place I wanted to take him to is not open today because they do parties on the weekend. So I don't really feel like going to Chuck E. Cheese, y'all. I'm probably just got to go get him a costume for tomorrow. And then I'm gonna have some quick treatment. Um, I'll see y'all um, so y'all this is where we had to come because the other place I wanted to take them to they were closed I think I said that in another clip prior to this but <sighs> I did not want to come here but here we are coming here but I told him we not staying that long baby we not staying that long Y'all, the ghetto. Somebody was just saying, arguing with the employees. Gotta go. Oh. Y'all, I got a new tripod. Hold on, y'all, a little dirty. But y'all, I got a new tripod. And I tell you, I'm so excited. Let me set it up real quick. Hold on, y'all. So y'all, look at how long this tripod is. Let me step back. And that's not even how high it goes. It go higher. Hold on. This is the tripod you need, literally, the one you need. It can go as short as you need it to, into a vlog stick, into a, and it holds a camera. It holds a cell phone, <clears throat> and it comes with the charger. Who wouldn't? I will put this in the link below. I got it from Amazon. This is the brand. A three and it's a three and one selfie stick, but baby, <laughs> we using it as a tripod. I'm about to put this phone on here, test it out. So y'all, look at the selfie Baby. stick. Okay. Baby, I got emergency. Yeah, you got emergency. <laughs> y'all, he just got a new watch. My friend got him. This is a Batman watch. He talking about he got an emergency because it's flashing with numbers. <laughs> y'all, this is so freaking cool. Hold on, let's see. I don't really know how you connect it. Connect the phone to it. Anyways. But y'all, this is the end of this weekend vlog. This is the end of this weekend vlog. If y'all hear a lot of noise in the bed, don't even worry about it. I got a house full of churn, honey. And it got them churns. Um, the barbecue that my daddy made, because baby. I'm gonna say I'm gonna make me up a light. Put them in plate. So y'all hold on. Let me show y'all this uh this barbecue. I used to have a hard time like finding a tripod long enough to stand up. So when I'm talking to y'all in the kitchen, y'all don't have to be down here and y'all just see everything going on. So when I tell you, I could not be more happy when you turn off this flash and like. Okay, just let her. Go get another 12 from my basket. 
Now, I don't know if the camera gonna be able to, but well, I might be able to take this capacity with y'all. Look at this. Sorry to the people that don't eat meat, but look at them ribs. Them hamburgers. Look at it. Look so good. Look at that chicken. Mm, mm, mm. Tuna macaroni. Mm, mm, mm. I'm about to make me a plate. Get ready to um, I want to put these kids down. Cool <laughs> yeah, <sighs> churn. Y'all, my nephew, he worked my nerves today. Like, this is like the worst thing I had with him. And he, uh, he ain't never had that many bad days. I think he probably had one bad day prior to this, but today was like one of the. One of his bad days, and he only had one before with me. I normally don't get exhausted with him, but baby, I think got exhausted with his behind day. For watching, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Oh, and don't forget to drop some questions down below so that I can make a QA and a for you guys. If you're new or old, drop a question, drop a question, drop a question, drop a question. And I'm gonna do a community tab just in case y'all don't you know i'm gonna do a community tab post too so or maybe i'll do an instagram post i do instagram post to tell me how to ask me questions for my q a for youtube so yeah i'm gonna um do that for y'all so thank y'all for watching i'll see y'all in the next one